Batu MP P. Prabakaran claims he was escorted by police out of the Taman Sri Muni Enhanced Movement Control Order area when he tried to get more information from the residents there. In a video on Facebook, Prabakaran claims he was chased out of the war room there and not treated like an MP. Prabakaran said he was there to assess the situation and the welfare of the people, which falls under his parliamentary constituency. Apabila saya masuk war room, saya saya masuk semua tempat dengan kebenaran tuan-tuan dan puan-puan. Bukan saya sengaja masuk. Tapi saya dihalau keluar, tidak dilayan secara uh, sebagai ahli parlimen. Saya nak bagi cadangan pun tak boleh, nak minta bantuan pun tak boleh. The Batu MP added that he came to the area after receiving several complaints that people there did not have enough kitchen essentials, medicine and milk. Saya masuk dalam untuk bincang pasal bantuan JKM dengan apa uh, inisiatif yang akan dibuat daripada kerajaan ini. Tapi saya dihalau keluar oleh timbalan menteri, saya dihalau keluar oleh anggota-anggota polis sebab saya bagi banyak cadangan kepada timbalan menteri. Saya tak pasti kenapa mereka halau saya, tapi saya hanya bagi tahu mereka ini adalah pengundi-pengundi saya. Later in the video, a policeman asked the Batu MP to come back, claiming that the deputy minister was asking for him to come back. Tadi saya bagi cadangan, tuan-tuan. Tadi saya bagi cadangan, kenapa taman wilayah tak tutup? Taman wilayah ada banyak warga asing. Menteri wilayah halau saya. Timbalan Menteri Wilayah halau saya, sekarang dia minta nak jumpa balik. Saya pun tak pasti kenapa ini. The people are in danger. Don't play politics. Ask him don't tell politics. Prabakaran later posted on his Facebook page that he was on the way to the Sento Police Headquarters to give a statement. The government had earlier declared its six enhanced movement control order at Pusat Bandar Utara in Kuala Lumpur and the area surrounding the Selayang Wholesale Market.